hey, hey, all right, everybody, look, I got another box. Right, okay, what's inside this box today? Well, on the front, it says Kai Wheats, and it's an articulating industrial boroscope. I've always wanted one of these. I've always wanted to try one of these. So today, I am going to try one, and we'll have a look. We'll unbox it. I'll try and put this camera in some strange places, some weird places, so we can have a look what it's all about. And we'll have a look what it's like. So let's get it unboxed. Okay, so let's have a look what's inside the box. It does say Kaiwitz on there, and the model is KBA01, 1.5 meter cable length, which is pretty good. So let's open it up and have a look inside and see what we got. Well, when we open it up, we've got a nice case that is in. So let's move the case out the way. Let's undo the old box here, the case, like that. Lift that open, and there we go. We have got the instruction user, user manual there. So let's take this out of the package there and have a look what it's like. This does look pretty good. And there we go. So there we go. We got a USB-A to USB-C. We have got something in this little thing here. Not quite sure what that is yet. We'll have a look in a minute. And then we've got the actual unit there with a nice long cable length But there. So let's get it out of the box, get it together, see how it works, and have a look what we can pick up on the screen. Right, okay, I've taken this panel off my car by here just to show you what it's like going inside something. Well, I haven't gone inside it yet, so we'll, we'll see it together. Now, the M button by here, you either, that changes it from taking a photo to video so we'll click video and then the red button here is to start the video um, we'll put the light on which is another button here so the light is on there can you see that there light is on and then we'll go inside there let's press record so it's recording now it does take an SD card it did come with an SD card in there uh, it's got SD card reset and USB on the side of there under that rubber thing there so let's go inside there and have a look what's going on. So we go down in there, down along there. I can see some leaves and some dirt. Doesn't look very clean. <laughs> um, now I want to go a little bit further along. So let's, let me just move this a second. Now the roller, the thing that rolls here, look, that wiggles that back and forth like that. So let's put that straight and then we'll go along there. And we'll just have a little look. We'll have a little look down there and see what we can see. So I can see some cobwebs. <laughs> and it's not rusty or anything, it's just a little bit dirty. But you can see all the way down to the other end of there, look. If I go a little bit further there. There we go. And it doesn't look blocked up to me at all. There's no like sediment at the bottom. If you know what I mean, look, there's no like, there's a little bit, but not too much. So that looks tickety boo. So let's take that out of there. And then I don't know if you can see down here. Let me see if you can see down there. Hang about. Yeah, you can see down there. So let's have a little peek down there. Not that you need to peek down there, but you never know. We'll have a look anyway. And then we'll have a look down there. Now I can see a lot of leaves. Well, I say a lot. I can see a few leaves down there. There is some some debris down there. Look, you can see it. So let's go and look at something else. Let's go and look at something a bit more exciting. Now, I haven't reviewed the footage yet, so when I edit this video, that's when I'll see this footage. We'll go and have a look at something a bit more exciting. Well, I'll try and find something more exciting, but let me just show you by here what I was talking about. If I come in a bit closer. Um, it did come with an SD card. Let me just check what it says on this SD card. It says it's uh, 32 gigabyte, so it did come with that. And it can record up to HD, that's 1080 times 1920. Uh, you can set the resolution lower if you want to. And I did say that it has got a USB-C port as well and a reset button. Um, and the record button is by there. Now, I did say there was a little, little box of things. I don't know if you can see there. I'll try and show you on here. It's got a, let me try and undo this here. I hope it's focusing now. If I can undo it, can I undo it? There we go. Right. At the end of this little camera here, it's got threads. I don't know if you can see that there. And you've got different fitments. And some of them, 
I've got mirrors on for getting into awkward positions. So we'll try that in a minute. So let's go and look at some more stuff. Now I did say earlier on that it came with these here. So let's just take these out of here again. Now I have got one of them. I did show you one of them is on the end and that there is to protect the is slightly proud of the lens so it protects the lens that one there I showed you earlier you've got this one here you can put on that's a hook so you can go in somewhere and you can hook the item and pull it back by using a by screwing it on the end of there uh, you've got this one here that's got a mirror that's just got a sticky thing on there there's a mirror on there, so it'll give you a different angle to see, where you, just in case, you know, something's obscured, you can use the mirror. And then this one here, I don't know if you can see that there, it's got a magnet on the end, so if you stick that on there, and it's something metal you want to get out, then you use the magnet and you can pull it back out, either with the magnet or with the hook. Right, okay, we'll do a little test. I'm going to stick this little key down this tube by here, this tube here this big pole it is blocked so far down now I've got the I don't know if it was, you can see that there look I've got the magnet thing on there now the camera is sort of pointing towards that magnet so you can see it on the screen a little bit um, but we'll try it out now this unit here also records audio I'm not quite sure where the mic is um, but I'll put the audio now of from this device here just to see what it's like it's not going to be as good as my microphone by here but we'll just see what it's like so the audio you're hearing now should be coming from here because i am recording on here so let's stick this actually first we'll put the key we put this key like that down in here oh that's gone inside it now lost forever no it's not because i got this <laughs> right here we go then let's get this round here like that and let's see how you can see it now. Let's poke that down there. This isn't, it's not, it's not easy doing this. You've got to try and put this down here and then try and straighten it up. I'm not, I'm not quite sure how far down the key is. Now I can't see the key at the moment, but I've, I've hit something here now. So let's see if the key comes back up with the thing and there's nothing on it. <laughs> So let's try again. The trouble is you can't see where the key is. Let's try again. We'll try again. We'll go down. I didn't seem to be hitting something there for some reason. I'm not quite sure when that is. And there we go. I have the key. <laughs> now, the only problem is, I don't know if you could see on the camera. I'll pop it down there again one more time just to show you. I'll put the key down, like so. You can't see past this, so it is a bit of a... You are doing it blind. So I suppose what you do is you would take this off first, like so. You take this off and look where the thing is. Then you know where it is. Then you'd put that on. Then you'd pop that down there, like so. Now, if it was to the side, I could see it, but I can't see past this thing. So when I get down, I gotta sort of fish around for it, like so, and then it should be on there, but it's not. So I'll try again. <laughs> I think I've I felt like something there. No, you've got to move it around. I can't quite. I, I can't see the key on the camera. See, that's the problem. No. Right. Let me get the other thing and see what it is. Let's get the other thing, because I don't want to push that down unless it's got a, the um, cover on it. So let me get the other thing, and we'll see where it is on that pipe, because I can't find it for the second time. Right, okay, so I've put that end on there. I've put that end on there so it doesn't damage the end of the camera. Now, i got to say as well that the light on the end there, it does, this camera needs a lot of light, and it needs to be close to something. So... If you do fear, like far away, it doesn't focus very well and doesn't look very good. But if I go close to say this piece of wood by here, like that, you should be able to see there that is getting all the green and everything. When the, when the light is shining on it, it does, you know, you can see all the green and stuff. So let's go down there and have a look where that key's gone. So <laughs> let me just put this straight like that. Let's 
pop that down there and we'll see if we can see the key so we're going down going down going down nearly there where's my key gone right there's like a blockage there isn't there see so let's try and turn that that way can't see it that way can't see it that way maybe the key has fallen past the gap maybe let's turn around that way and have a look no that way there that key's definitely oh there it is there's the key there is the key look it's standing upright so the key is there and it's right I'm assuming it's at the back of there isn't it so let's take this back out I know this is a long uh, <laughs> segment but let's take this off again now we know where the key is it's easier said than done. Now you have got to move it around a bit. But we've got to get the key back. It's an important key. So let's put the magnet back on. Let's put this straight because that does wiggle back and forth. Let's put that like that. I think that's about straight there. And I think it was at the back somewhere. So let's just get down there like that. See if we can find it this time. No, is it on this side? We know it's in there. <laughs> Let me see if we can get the key to fall flat. There we are, the key's flat now. <coughs> So it should be easier to pick up. I think it's because the key was standing up. There we are, look, see? <laughs> because the key was standing up, the key was actually like that, standing up, so it was hard to get the magnet on there. So you can see that some things are tricky. Okay, then, there you go. That's my review of the Kai Wheats Boroscope. All the links will be down in the description below, so take a look down below if you're interested in having one of these. Now, if you did like this video, don't forget to give it a like, subscribe, and I will catch you in the next one. Hoi!